when we drill as much as possible and prices come down, how does that affect companies? Wouldn't that, would that bring their value down? How does that affect which companies? Say uh, an oil company, say a okay. Chevron or a... Well, let's look at... I think it's natural to say, hey, if, if oil is cheaper and they can't sell it for as much, how are they going to continue to make money type or how are they going to make as much as they have type thing? Good, very good question. When you think of it that way, first of all, um, if you're an oil company and you and your product becomes cheaper, the only way there for your bottom line, your revenues will become less, assuming constant demand. But if demand it goes cheaper, generally, depending on the elasticity, which is a word some of you guys might know, mm -hmm. of the demand curve, we would see how much price would change because of the reduced demand. So in the case of an oil company, oil companies may have less um, revenue per barrel, but guess what? America was an exporter of oil, not an importer. America has all the oil we need for our own country. We don't need oil from Saudi Arabia or Russia, the other major producing oil countries. So for our companies, I see, yes, I do see some price hurt, uh, uh, appreciation of stock prices like Exxon Mobil, and even to some extent, my all planes, American and energy transfer companies having a headwind in one level, well, especially Exxon, because the price is cheaper, but some of that will be made up with increased demand, right? Because the, they're, you know, the, the quantity demanded will, pro, will be higher based on the elasticity curve of demand for oil if oil is cheaper. On the other hand, for a company that needs oil for a shipping company, all of a sudden, guess what? Their expenses are lower. If their expenses are lower, that means their profits are higher. So all things being the same there, those companies will have an advantage.